if I can bring it back a little bit then. So we mentioned that you work with agencies and you do automation. Can you bring that to life yeah. a little bit for the audience out there? Like what kind of agencies are your ideal clients? Yeah. And what do you mean by an automation? Some simple examples, if you could. So I think the main thing is like yeah. agencies that are digital, obviously, and got a lot of things going on. So I'll just run a couple of examples of automations and then you can see whether they resonate with you. So first off, you've got client on board and that's one that I always get asked to do. So when you sign on a new client, you want to create the Google folders, add them to spreadsheets and send over documents, invoices. We automate that whole process to save your employees a lot of time. Another one is meet and book and see online. Now you're always on Zoom calls like this. We can automate notifications on the back of the Zoom call bookings and some other ones are just little ins and outs within the business. So when a deal gets moved in HubSpot or in Pipedrive, we're then going to send a notification or we're going to update Trello, just little movements within the business. So it's more for the agencies where they're trying to expand. They've got a lot of things going on, but you're not at the stage where you want to hire another employee yet, but you're at the stage where you're starting to lose control of operations. You're thinking there's a lot going on. We need to dial things in. And that's the main people that I go for, which is, as you're starting to expand, you realize you need more time and automation frees that time up for you.